You get mostly local artists, uh, anywhere from amateur to professional. And um, they're usually doing their own artwork, original artwork, or um, commission work for their art. It's just a small shop. I have to do a lot of special ordering. But that's what we do, and usually every week I have to make an order, a special order. So it'd be like specialty paints, um, special mediums that we don't normally carry, like maybe alcohol inks or, uh, or a brand name that is not real popular, but somebody might be used to using that uh, over the years. And uh, sometimes we'll order them and then keep them in the store on, in stock so that we'll have them for other people as well. The front part of the store is an art gallery for the local artists. We do monthly shows, and it can be anything. It can be paintings, uh, pottery, any medium in painting. It could be watercolor, oil painting, acrylic painting. And um, the shows run for a month. It's a good niche to provide. It's what I needed, because I used to have to always go to Junction for my art supplies, and so did everybody else. So it makes it a, a good thing to have something local and it's just easier for people then to procure their art supplies. And people prefer to shop them locally instead of, well, some people buy online, but you don't get to feel or sample the, the supplies. And artists are pretty tactile, so they like to sort of just feel and handle what they're buying. So that's why we wanted a brick and mortar store.